one. Once again, we on Light Skin Television. This is Female Battle Rap Movement. This is the show. This is episode three. We got Jaleesa Bree in the house. Did I pronounce it right? You did. You did. Okay. Jaleesa Bree is in the house. Tell these people where you're from. You're a battle rapper up and coming. We seen you on Pirate last night. You know what I mean? Yeah, uh, originally from Jersey. Uh, Part shout of Jersey. out to home. Uh, Newark, actually. From okay. Bricks. I went to Rowan University. I lived in Jersey for 12 and a half years. I was off of Avon Ave. That block right there, that was my school. Okay, that's what's up. That's what's up. North Jersey, Newark. So from Bricks. there I moved here. I've been, I've been a South Carolina Braves cat for a minute. So been okay. out here for a good 18 years. All right. Understand a big time Pittsburgh Steelers fan like me too, huh? Yes. That's big time. Talking about. Yeah, big that's time. what I'm talking about. Still a nation, PS4L. That's All what right. I'm talking about. All right. So um you want to start from the beginning or you want to start from last night? Well, shoot, my beginning technically started behind closed doors. Okay. Um, doing tryouts and shit. Thanks and shout out to Ton. For giving me a shot and Shout out my man, uh, Corleone. him and blessing all them for seeing Bless the shot, uh, seeing the potential in me for okay. real. How long ago was um, this? This was like Christmas time, around Christmas time. They had tryouts. Well, we had tryouts in the last mm -hmm. year. Okay, you already, yeah, already making noise. Just stepped in the game, pure rookie for real. Mm -hmm. And from there, I got my first uh online battle with dead stop uh shout out to him for being a good sport okay um totally fucked that nigga up sorry to say but i knew happened. something cynical was coming behind <laughs> that <shot. laughs> i felt it coming i felt it coming nah it but uh he did as good as he could do huh yeah he he did but i i pray to see and i hope to see him doing well definitely we we Started training out rookies together. We damn sure rookies together, so we gonna work together. And that footage dropped. Uh, it's on. It's on. Um, it's in the Pyrex Battle page. Actually. Okay, you got to go to Facebook page for Pyrex Battle League. Mm-hmm. Right, so Pablo was the host. Here. Okay, Pablo's the host. All right, bet. So last night, who was your opponent? My opponent is none the other than Dynasty. And if y'all don't know him by Dynasty, you will definitely know him by LL, or as we call him, Lawrence. Corny cat, funny fellow, and he been on his toes last night. And like me and him talk behind the scenes, uh -huh. we really uh -huh. wanted to give everybody a great fucking show, write uh, the best shit we could, and just do our fucking best and show people we really fucking, we can rap. So right. and we damn sure did the fuck what we did. Yeah, I'm so proud of my opponent. He came the fuck out and he showed the fuck up. He did, he did. The crowd was nice too. The crowd, yeah, they was really receptive to both of y'all. Facts. Yeah, facts. And shout out to the crowd for showing me love. Like for real. I wasn't expecting it and I wasn't hoping for it, but I was I was hoping to get my bars off and I did just that. You got a nice little pen too, I noticed. Thank you. Thank mm -hmm. you. Mm-hmm. Look, you took a uh <laughs> you took a shot at your own self. I didn't. I didn't expect that coming. You threw everybody off. We got a little giggle out of that. You said something about the way you was built. For real, because it, it's it's the truth. I can't do <laughs> nothing but say the truth. So like, if you gonna come at me, yeah, tell me with some shit I ain't hear. I've been hearing all this bullshit all my life, man. Right. And I grew you kind of beat them to it. Like, yeah, for real. I grew up with titties in no ass. So it's like, there's <laughs> nothing you can say that I ain't hear. Tell me something new. You want to talk about my pimples? Okay. All righty. Uh, I'm out of shape. I am. I'm not going to lie. You want to talk about I'm an alcoholic? I could be. Yeah, I probably am. I drink whiskey all the time. Keep it with me. <laughs> so you're going to have to come with some real shit. Or right. Like, something come different, with huh? something clever. Yeah, mm -hmm. for real. Come with something clever because I'm not somebody you can embarrass. I'm really not. Mm -hmm. All my demons, I'm, I've dealt with them. So there's nothing nobody can really get in my head about. Right. Let me ask you this. Um, how long have you actually been watching and studying battle rap before you actually uh, endeavored into it? Uh, about five or six years ago. Okay. Five or six years ago. 
And when I started knowing who Tun was and getting to know him and his wife and them, and they uh, found out I do music. Tun was like, oh, you do music? You can rap? I was like, yeah, I can rap. He's like, you want to rap? I was like, nah. You said, nah. <laughs> You wasn't I don't with know. it as a I child. Sit yeah. back and watch now. Okay. And that's what I did. I sat back and I watched for some years. You know, I dealt with the demons I had in my closet, but I sat back and I watched for some years and I peeped the game. And I noticed I'm not like everybody else. Like, yeah, I'm different. I'm a storyteller. Everybody just gets straight to the punch. I'm a right. storyteller. I love shit like that, even in my music. So it's 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 different. And I want to show how unique my pen can be. If okay. that makes sense. Okay. That do make sense. That do make sense. All right. So what was some of the first battles you watched that really um really you you know gravitate had you gravitate towards battle rap and wanting to battle? Well, not even so much wanting to battle rap, but what made you what some of the matches that you like which you that you saw first that made you love battle rap? In person, actually the first time I ever saw an actual battle that wasn't on YouTube. Mm-hmm was literally a Pyrex battle. And that nice. was a fuck the ops night. The first fuck the ops card. Mm. Shout out to all them fellas that was on that card. Uh they did their motherfucking thing. Uh but there was one battle in particular that was dope as shit. And that was the uh Jack and Chef battle. That shit was my opinion battle of the night. Uh still watch that shit to this day. That shit was fire. Uh uh-uh. uh, it was a uh, chef scooter. Okay, okay, it was straight Pyrex, huh? Yeah, that was that was with. Oh man, that was like two thousand and what's what's today? Twenty eight, sixteen, seventeen, maybe. Okay, okay. So yeah, that was like back then. That was yeah. That's when Pyrex was just started. And what about they Farm? had some fire shit. Facts. Shout out to Pyrex. It, yeah, it was the fuck the ops card. That was the first, the first one I actually attended. Okay. That was the first one I attended. The fuck the fuck the ops card. That shit was fucking dope. And it what? was it was like no other. It really was. To be inside there, to hear the shit, to hear the crowd reaction and shit. It was like no other. And to hear people get their pen off mm-hmm. and the, you know. Cause I'm a I'm a corny person, but I'm a punning type of person. Okay. So I like to come up with stupid ass corny puns just to be stupid. Okay. Uh, Entertaining. So, yeah, you know, dad bar, uh-huh. so to say. Right. And so I like shit like that. And of course, I've been in the music since I was a kid. So like hearing stuff like that to me is like going to uh, poetry night. Honestly. Okay. What about as far as mainstream battle rap, like on YouTube, like you said, what was some of the the first matches you saw that you really liked, really impressed you? Annie Battle Prestavian, I'm a fan of hers. Oh, really? She is fucking dope. She is dope. She is Mm -hmm. out of the box. She really is. She definitely started two years after her, you know? Yeah. um, yeah. If I could ever meet her in person, shake her hand, take a picture, that'd be We could hook that up. We could definitely hook that up. Um, Dude, I, I don't even gotta be on a car with her just to be in the room. I'd be like, hey, She's a real up? nice person, too. You know what I mean? And you can in tell battle rapper, that, yeah, real sweet lady. Yep. That aura, that aura that pops off her, you can tell. Yep, that's a fact. All right, you talking about music? Like, how long have you been making music? How long you been rapping, rapping? I've been doing music since I was in school. That was like, 15 years ago. I'm 27 right now. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So that was like 15 years ago. I've been in music and, you know, doing music. Of course, you know, growing up in the church, you be in a choir and shit like that. But writing music, I used to write uh, gospel songs. Really? Okay. Yeah. I used to uh, write regular, you know, just little music as a kid. And then we did little... <laughs> That's what I call hillbilly recording in the back in the back of the house when I was a kid too. So I think a lot of people uh, did that, you know. Pretty much, pretty much. If anybody really loved music and they did it, yeah, they did it. They they found a way to do it. 
You didn't care uh, how weak your uh, recording equipment out, was. But... You just want to hear yourself back type thing. I know all about that, yeah. Exactly. I never really put any shit out. I think I probably won't. I'm probably more so might go into just ghostwriting. Okay, Shoot. well, there's money in that. I know it is. It is. Yeah, yeah. You might not get as might many rather accolades. Might be behind the, the scenes so I can spend more time with the kids. I'd rather, you know, build forth and shit with my That's children. That's smart. There you go. There you go. For real. Aspirations in battle rap. What do you What do you care to get out of this? Uh, I care to bring something new to the table. Uh, I don't hear a lot of mom bars, even though I know they are moms. Mm. You hear a lot of op using motherhood against the op opposition, but you don't hear too many MCs yeah, talking about them being mothers. Yeah, you don't hear a lot mother. of mom bars. I want to okay. come with the clever shit, like shit right. you don't hear. Um, of course, I'm a mom. Um, I want to hear some shit like that. Just so, you know, I know we want to relate because we watch the shit too. We watch right. it. And it's not a lot of females out there. It really ain't. And the scarce few that it is, they they just rotating the clip and battling each other. So yeah, you've yet to battle a woman. So what's is that going? Does that feel going to be different, or is it going to be more uh, comfortable to you? You think? I can't hear you. What you say? I said you've yet to battle a woman. When you do, do you think that's yes. going to be more comfortable for you? Or is that going to be uh, being that you're used to battling men? I, is that going to be a? Ironically, my first battle was supposed to be a chick. And really? she never showed up. Who was it? Yeah, yeah. Well, she never put showed her on blast. up. She going on blast right her now. Her name is supposed to be Madam G. So Madam I, G. she was okay. supposed to be coming in as a newcomer. And so was oh, I. Oh, okay, okay. Never got to meet her. Um, Something happened. She just she got cold feet. Do battle. Okay. And if she do, right. I really hope she come to battle for real. All right. We hope to hear from you, Madam G. You know what I mean? Maybe the next time you find a way to make it. You know what I mean? Definitely. Uh Pyrex Battle League. Seems like y'all y'all like a family. You know what I mean? Y'all yeah. seem pretty strong. You know what I mean? The crowd is strong crowd and everything. Y'all support each other, but y'all seem like y'all be going in on each other on that page too. Hell yeah. We gotta give each other hell. You yeah. gotta you gotta <laughs> literally make your motherfucking like for real. If you can't make your, your brother or your sister better, mm -hmm. then what the fuck are we doing? And what are we doing what while we're here? Yeah. For real. Mm -hmm. So sometimes it may seem like we bullshitting or like we arguing or whatever, we bitch around, but now nah, like we just trying to push it, push you to do better, push you to be okay. a better person, push you to, you know. So nah, never take it as, well, I don't know. Sometimes them niggas might be for real. Sometimes them mm -hmm. niggas might be for real, but I feel like we a family for okay. real. It's Pyrex is like no other. I have felt nothing but love from all these people. Okay. And all of them were definitely willing to help. Even though I was like, nah, let me let me try something first. Yeah. And then we talk about it. Like, okay. you know, so I wanted to see or show them my potential, mm -hmm. what I can do. And then come on, let's look, let, then let's work together. Come on, let's, you know, but I had uno momento por favor. Um, I had um a couple of them talk to me, coach me, you know, give me some insights, and I I very much appreciate them for their insights because that was my first time actually being on the stage to battle. Right. And uh, I hope I did them proud because whew, I tried my best. I tried my best in the hills. Right. Cause that ain't me. <laughs> I love hills. Don't get me wrong. Now they uh -huh. cute. Hard but to battle with her. Yeah. We're going to wear the kicks to them that just fall off all day. Uh -huh. Give me three leagues that you watch that you think will be interesting to battle on, like you may aspire to battle. Oh, dang. If, if I ever. If there are three. Three leagues that I actually watch, if I ever. Oh, my gosh. That means I'm doing great. That means I'm doing great. And that will be URL. The Gates of the Garden and um oh three BL. Gates of the Garden is not hard to get on. <laughs> hey, listen, some, <laughs> it's it's all in who you know. It's all, it's all in who you know. 
we'll talk off off screen. But <laughs> now I know what you're saying. I love the league. I ain't taking no, you know, no shots at Gates of the Garden. I support them to the fullest. But it's like if you want to get on Gates of the Garden and they come somewhere close to you, oh, you can and get on. bullpen league. Oh man. They're dope. You like bullpen? Why don't you come down to the John, next John, John, John John's fucking dope. Um, I, I like him as a battler. He's pretty dope. Come on down to the next event. Let you know, let everybody talk to you. If I can, I tell y'all, I'm a mom, man. Shoot. I understand. Uh, yeah, okay, let's cover that then. Let that be the last thing we cover. 85% of y'all is moms, you know what I mean? And, and y'all seem to juggle it pretty well for the most part. Most women do. Women battle rappers. Um what are some of the challenges you think that could come with you in the future being booked for, you know, bigger battles, bigger looks, and being a mother? Like, you think you'd be able to juggle that? Or, um, of course, the priority is the family this, first. I'm going to say this now, child okay. care. And I ain't going to cap about that. Okay. Because, you know, everybody's, you know, situation ain't the same. That's so, exactly true, um, yeah. hey, you guys. Hold on for a second. No problem. Hey, you guys, can y'all take that noise over there? Hey, take the noise over there. I'm going to give you my shoes. First time I got muted on the show. That's what's up. Jaleesa Bree recently was on Pyrex Battle League. So, yeah, y'all check okay, that out. Okay, sorry yeah, about she that. Back. She back. So, uh, you say yeah. child care. Yeah, child care is a motherfucker. Everybody's situation ain't the same. But mm -hmm. I promise you, give me enough notice in advance. And right. I'm saying this up front. Give me enough notice in advance. I'm going to make a way. All That's right. a fact. I'm going to make a way. That's what I'm talking about. Get these people your social media so they know how to contact you, find your battles and things of that nature. You can definitely find me on Facebook, Julissa Bree, Instagram, Julissa Bree, and uh, yeah, well, at Julissa Bree. Because they got you got two at, S's in there, they might mess it up. Oh wait, yeah, sorry, mm -hmm. Julissa Bree, actually J A L I S S A B R I, and then at Julissa Bree on Instagram and at Julissa Bree on TikTok. I don't get on TikTok so much, but I'm gonna try to get back up there. I'm going to try to get back up there. I used to put some stuff up there, but I ain't been up there in a minute. Before we part, tell them what, as far as your battle rap style, what is your greatest attribute? My greatest attribute? Oh, my jokiness. And... Yeah, you had them laughing last night, yeah. You got a few laughs in there, definitely. My jokiness and um, that sense of humor going on with the bars. Huh? Mm, another one. My ability to say some real shit mm -hmm. that'll be up uplifting that just catch you off guard sometimes. It'll capture the crowd. They they can relate to it. Yeah, if they if they pay attention. Okay, but. My ability in battle rap, oh yeah, I'm always gonna stack them double entendres if I can or uh, triple entendres. Okay. If they catch them, you work that pin. You be working that pin. All right. Got the doubles. I try to. Okay. I try to. I try to. We definitely but look forward. I really want to. Wanna, I really want to do some shit. Okay. All right. We look forward to that. I really appreciate your time. Jaleesa Bree on Female Battle Rap Movement. This is the show. This is episode three. I'm Light Skin You, a.k.a. DJ Super God of Light Skin Television. We be looking forward to seeing you. We got your social media. We know where to go watch your battles. Pyrex Battle League. You know what I mean? Definitely. We look forward to everything that you're going to do in the future and what you're doing now. Appreciate you, right. sister. Pittsburgh still is right. Appreciate you too, love. Awesome. Yo, no problem. No problem. Anytime. Anytime, you know, you'll invite it time. back whenever you want to come back. You know what I mean? For real. Right. Definitely. And listen, when we go to the uh, Super Bowl in the next three years, because we got to regroup. We got to oh, regroup. Yeah, okay? yeah. We, we did that this regroup. weekend in the draft. I was down at the draft covering that joint for the 17th time. I don't I'm trying know. To tell you, I'm trying to tell you, Pittsburgh still We're gonna is coming We're going to need a couple more. Yeah. We're going to need a couple more. That's a fact. That's a fact. But we about to do so, this. So we really gonna have to work, but 
We gonna meet when we get to the Super Bowl. I promise you. I like to cook, so I'm a cooker for a fact. I cook for a living. We both do. We'll cook together. That's what we do. Facts. You you keep cooking in that ring. That's what we need you to do. And will. And will. All right. Jaleesa Bree, Light Skin Television. We out. We out.